Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to be shedding light on what is a marketing manager. So what is a marketing manager, you may ask, without further ado, without further delay, allow me to demystify the answer to that inquiry right here, right now. But before I do so, I just wanted to preface this video by stating that the role of a marketing manager can vastly vary from marketing manager to marketing manager. So just be acutely aware of that. Allow that to marinate in the chasms of your mind, the scope of responsibilities that a marketing manager bears a brunt of can vastly vary from marketing manager to marketing manager. So just allow that to seep into the bowels of your mind. So as a marketing manager, you'll be responsible for managing the marketing campaigns of your clients. You employ marketing strategies, you employ marketing tactics, you oversee and manage marketing activities on behalf of your clients or on behalf of an employer. So as a marketing manager, you're on the forefront of the marketing campaigns. You're in the vanguard of the marketing campaigns. You're at the helm of the marketing campaigns. Metaphorically speaking, you manage, you oversee the marketing efforts and marketing activities. And it can be an onerous burden to be a marketing manager, to say the least. You definitely have to have a meticulous nature you should be highly knowledgeable, highly competent, and highly adept in the niche field of marketing. You want to be able to optimize your marketing campaigns. You want to be able to yield the highest possible conversion rates. You want to be able to create advertisements that resonate with your target market. You want to be able to organically help to cultivate brand growth, brand equity, brand recognition, brand loyalty, and secure the lifetime values of the customers a part of the target market so as a marketing manager you will work on behalf of your clients to optimize their digital marketing campaigns such as their enticing pay-per-click marketing campaigns you can refine them over time by omitting the unprofitable elements from the marketing campaigns and optimizing the profitable elements unprofitable elements should be jettisoned from the marketing campaigns so that your clients are not hemorrhaging marketing dollars. You should always ascertain the return on investment per marketing campaign in order to assess whether or not it's worth perpetually funding this marketing campaign or if you should desist from doing so. Do not misallocate your clients marketing dollars spend them prudently you need to be shrewd and judicious you should not needlessly squander your clients marketing dollars you should act in the best interest of your clients and not in their worst interest you should not shirk on fulfilling your responsibilities and performing your due diligence as a marketing manager. So, as a marketing manager, you should be highly knowledgeable about the domains of marketing. You should meticulously understand content marketing, social media marketing, digital marketing, mobile marketing, internet marketing, video marketing, and other niche marketing fields. You should always amplify your knowledge base, especially in the domain of search engine optimization so that you can know how to better optimize your, con your clients social media content, articles, videos, and marketing campaigns. You want to help your clients to not only foster brand growth, brand recognition, brand loyalty, and brand equity, but also want to be able to help their social media content to organically build traction over time. It's not just about leveraging 
direct marketing tactics to drive an influx of traffic to your client's website or to their product pages or to their social media platforms. You need to know far more than just how to leverage direct mail advertisements, bulletin board advertisements, billboard advertisements, television advertisements, radio advertisements, podcast advertisements, and pay-per-click marketing campaigns to vector traffic to your client's website, product pages, or social media platforms. But you should also know how to organically create social media content on behalf of your clients in order to help them to cultivate a behemoth of a robust brand and in order to help them to build a sizable lucrative clientele. If your client's brand has won over the trust of the target market before they start offering services or products to the market, then prospective customers will be all the more inclined to procure your client's service offerings or procure your client's products if your client's brand has already won over the target market's trust before any products are released. For customers to procure or before any service offerings are available for customers to procure. As a marketing manager, you may be managing teams. You need to understand how to employ efficacious marketing strategies on behalf of your clients. You need to meticulously understand how to employ potent marketing tactics on behalf of your clients. You need to always expand your repertoire amplify your knowledge base and become all the more competent so that you can furnish your clients as a marketing manager with better service offerings. You want to be able to attain favorable client outcomes you want to minimize the cost per acquisition. Maximize the conversion rate. And optimize marketing campaigns on behalf of your clients. You should meticulously understand the target market's needs. You should know how to meticulously analyze customer-driven analytics so that you can refine, revamp, augment, enhance marketing campaigns on behalf of your clients. You want to be able to elicit the highest possible conversion rate on behalf of your clients. You want to be able to help them to foster a robust lucrative behemoths of a brand and render their brand all the more profitable. How can you do so? You can do so by optimizing the marketing campaigns in order to minimize marketing costs and to maximize conversion rates. You need to know how to create content on a multitude of social media platforms that resonates eminently well with the target market. If your client's brand is able to win over the trust of 
prospective customers before they procure products or service offerings from your client's brand, then it will yield favorable results because when they're primed, when they're poised, when they're ready and rearing to procure service offerings or products, they will take heed of procuring them from your client's brand if your client's brand already won over their trust. So become a highly knowledgeable, highly competent, highly adept industry expert in your niche field of expertise, which in this context would be marketing if you want to attain marketing manager status. So as a marketing manager, You will spearhead your client's marketing operations. You will manage their marketing efforts, marketing activities, and you may delegate responsibilities to team members if you have any. You will manage their marketing campaigns. You will optimize their marketing campaigns. You will employ efficacious marketing strategies. You will utilize potent marketing tactics. You will make an earnest, valiant, gallant attempt to attain a high conversion rate on behalf of your clients. You will attempt to optimize your marketing campaigns, minimize the cost per acquisition, and you will also utilize indirect marketing tactics to cultivate brand growth. as well as to help them to secure the lifetime values of clients. You want to do everything in your purview to ensure that you're able to foster brand growth, brand recognition, brand loyalty, and brand equity. You want to help your clients to build a behemoth of a lucrative, robust brand that the client's target market trusts and is willing to procure products and services from when they're in dire need of them. If you can win over their trust prematurely in advance, then the target market will be all the more inclined to procure your clients' service offerings or product offerings. So just allow that to marinate in the chasms of your mind. As a market manager, your responsibilities are eminently extensive and You should know how to churn out compelling enthralling meritorious content on social media platforms on behalf of your clients to help them to foster brand growth, build a subscriber base, and allow their social media channels to build traction. You need to know how to drive traffic to the client's website, the client's product pages, or the client's social media channels. You need to understand brand cohesiveness. You need to understand how all these variables can work harmoniously together to yield favorable long-term results for your clients. So it's not just about Leverage and pay-per-click marketing campaigns to drive traffic to your client's website. But it's also about utilizing social media channels producing meritorious content for the social media platforms and being able to organically cultivate a clientele, a subscriber base, so that when products and services are available, they will be all the more easier to sell to the target market, especially if you have sizable established followings on a multitude of social media platforms and especially if your client's brand has already won over 
the trust of prospective customers and of the target market before products and services are released. So I hope that you found this video to be insightful as well as engrossing. Have a blissful day. Goodbye.